the greatest satisfaction is in knowing that you, as a human being, made something better for another human being. And you feel it at your core, not in any way, any uh, self-serving way, but just, just a human satisfaction. And of course, to me, it's surrounded by a great big old frame of love. Well, back in the 1980s, uh, I was the Vice President for Academic Affairs for President Strait. And uh, I really, really enjoyed that position because this was a student-oriented university. Uh, I am currently on the board of Arts and Humanities. Judy has been provost of Fresno State and consequently she knows all of the disciplines across campus, but she chose our college as a focus of her support because she loves the arts so much. She knows that they transform lives and so she wanted to make sure that our college received her special attention. Now that she's retired from her remarkable career as a president of two different universities after serving as our provost. When you look at the purpose of higher education, to me, the two most important things is to help you make a living, but how to make a life. And the part on how to make a life is where arts and humanities come in because it's the arts and humanities who make us most human. When I was a little girl, I had a very supportive mother, and my sisters and I, we used to put on shows on our fireplace stage. I loved reading. I had a very impressive fourth grade teacher, Mrs. Walker, and she infused me with the love of reading. And she also inspired me and taught me how to write poetry. Judy has had a tremendous impact on the College of Arts and Humanities. She is a visionary leader who teaches us that glass ceilings are artificial and that at the end of the day, it's the personal connection to each other that matters the most. It's this understanding of who we are as human beings and what we are trying to construct here as a society that is at the core of the college. Well, I've been a donor all my life. When I was little and growing up, my mom had a rule. When you get your first paycheck, you take the first third and you give that to something worthwhile. But as an adult, I developed rules for giving. Jerry and I would give generously to the institution that we were part of at the time. I give to the College of Arts and Humanities in Fresno State because that's where my involvement. Judy has been a Dean's Council member for a very long time and thanks to her generosity through Dean's Council, students are able to have amazing experiences both abroad here at the university within our community they return to us, the students, with a new vision of what the world is, and they in turn then enrich our own communities. Our students are able to go to conferences, they're able to uh, perform, they're able to get internships, thanks to her generosity and thanks to her true love for arts and humanities. To influence students' lives positively is just so important, and we do that through our donations. We're put on this planet to love, period, ourselves and others. And I know that sounds simplistic, but I believe that with all my heart.